Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we are going to see about Shiva and where uh, the coin is pretty much flat actually. So on, on, on a week we are seeing around 20% down and then on a day it's almost 8% down. Uh, in terms of the market cap is around 22 billion. Um, it, it's, it's pretty much lower than what we saw like 2-3 weeks ago and the volume is around 3.3 billion. Uh, it used to be 5-6 billion like you know so the volume has decreased in terms of dollar amount. Uh, and the typical hold time is pretty good guys it's around 26 days so day by day is getting increased actually and we have quite a few articles today where i'm sure like your hopes can get high by seeing this kind of articles uh so it seems like shib is was the fifth most held token on the entire ethereum network so that's quite big actually because yeah you see you got uh, tokens like polygon and you know uh saitama you know all all the major coins like solana um is, uh, runs on the ethereum network uh in this sense where if ship is uh, you know uh, one of the fifth held most coin in the ethereum network is kind of big actually so here in this article you can see the top first coin is the tether uh and then uh, you know uh, followed by ship in the fifth place and then the good thing for ship is guys is like it's almost reaching 1 million you know uh, holders which is which is kind of big actually um, because you see a lot of it's almost 15000 you know, crypto countries uh, you know are running across uh, you know the globe but uh, ship is in the top 12 13 position uh, even though it's been cooled off uh, almost 50% in the last you know 2 3 weeks so so that's 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 a great news as well so i mean don't don't, don't panic sell that's because you know if, if you panic sell obviously you lose money each and every time when you panic sell so i don't think it's it's the right time to do any panic selling uh, guys and the other thing guys is um, it seems like you know for example you see here uh, the following uh, listing the ship when it, when it came on coinbase it seems like the token recorded an inflow of almost 870 billion in terms of volume you know the, you know volume means what it's it's buy and sell of the coins within the 24 hours which means that you got kraken and robinhood on the way uh, robinhood in terms of the users Robinhood has almost 25 million users so it's which is almost double the amount of you know um, coinbase so that might be a big positive catalyst coming ahead so we just have to wait and watch you know what the price is going to uh, you know move forward uh, in a, in upward direction so I, I really want i'm not really worried about you know the, the, the price action now because uh, the, the first thing i would ask myself is why would i you know invest in this coin uh, if i don't have any any faith in this coin in, in, in a short term loss then i shouldn't be investing because this is cryptocurrency uh, we will usually see kind of you know 30 to 40% you know swings um, across you know all the cryptocurrencies because also the almost the, most of the market is pretty much flat actually if you go to the coin market cap uh, here you can see for the last 24 hours you can see almost ethereum is two percent down and then solana is around eight percent down um and then xrp is first three percent down and then on <clears throat> so it's pretty it's not that bad actually shiba inu obviously uh because of the crypto ban in india it seems like the indian government is trying to ban cryptocurrency in india which is not going to happen because <laughs> any country uh, specifically cannot uh, ban any cryptocurrency that's because it's beyond the country uh, it's, it's decentralized in the complete blockchain so obviously I don't think that's going to happen, uh, but they might regulate it for the, for the tax purposes. All We all know that, you know, like like China, we saw when China was, um, uh, you know, ba uh, we hear the news from China where they're going to ban the cryptocurrency. We see Bitcoin dipping them all the way to 50K and 30K. But you see in the next three, four weeks, it's going all the way to 63,000 to the all time highs. So I'm not uh, pretty much worried about that, uh, guys. So and uh, one more thing guys so if if we see the coinbase now uh, the, the 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 price dipped actually to 00036 quad 036 but then i think that the, the uh, everyone is expecting that the support line is around 36 but um, i'm i'm thinking that the, the next support line would be point quad 028 you know quad 028 would be the next support line so i wouldn't be in, i wouldn't be surprised if that dips to quad 028 and then get back all the way to 0 0.56 and 65 and uh, if if it if it you know um, crosses 0 0.65 then probably we are seeing all time highs that's not going to happen un until i think because it's, it's the thanksgiving uh, weekend you see that the us has got a big holiday um, coming up this thursday where the market is closed even the share market is closed actually and then friday is also kind of a half a day in in the us so us plays a ma plays a ma major you know part in the crypto business and you know all the most of the big whales i'm hoping it's coming from the us so what, what do you think guys you, you, um, so please leave your opinion you know on, on the comment section whether the the 
you know, Shiva, you know, is going to be uh, going to the moon or it's going to dip even more further. So please leave me a comments and uh, a big disclaimer, guys. Um, I'm not a financial advisor. So uh, please do your own research before investing in any coins. The If you're seeing my video, it's not a, it's not advice for you to hold, buy or sell any crypto coins. So please make sure that you do your own research. Uh, and I hope uh, uh, you have a great day. Thank you so much.